Global Home Diva, and in today's video, we are going to be touring the boss. Now, the boss is out here at Oakwood Homes in Lexington, South Carolina. It is truly the boss. Let's get into the video. All right, so as usual, we're going to start from the exterior of the home. This is the boss, you guys, out here at Oakwood Homes in Lexington, South Carolina. Uh, if the home is not still available on site, they can order the home for you as well as direct you to other locations. I believe this home is also in Greenville, South Carolina at Oakwood Homes. As a matter of fact, the interior pictures that I posted actually show uh, this home in a different exterior color as well as interior colors. So what we're doing now is walking around the home, just give you an idea of the size of the home, what it looks like from the outside. Again, the, uh, the online photos show this house in a different color. So uh, you can get this home in darker colors. Um, if this is something that you don't care for, the white exterior, I think it's really pretty. But I personally would like maybe a clay color or a grayish green or a blue um, in a home. So it's really up to your discretion. But you have versatility in the purchasing uh, of this home because you get to pick what exterior and interior and interior homes that you like as you can see this home has lots of windows and we're going to get inside and see what they look like um, but it does have lots of windows which lets you know that this home brings in lots of natural light from the outside so we'll give you a sneak peek of the blueprint of course you can freeze and take a look at this and then let's go ahead into the home so you can check out why they call this home the boss so here we have um, what you see when you enter the home. Nice, bright, light colors in this house. Lots of natural light coming in. This is a nice size living room. I love the fact that it has a ceiling fan and that it's open to the kitchen and dining room, but still has a sense of being a separate room. I also like the fact that the common areas of this home do not have carpet it helps to keep the floors cleaner and it helps for it to look nicer when you don't have to worry about stains or dirt build up or pet hair and build up and things of that nature on your carpet so really lovely size room you actually have space to make a sort of entryway here um and again you especially for entertaining can see into the kitchen and into the dining room but also have a sense of separation so really really lovely there you have a big area here for your dining space a built-in buffet section you've got uh, open shelving in this room really lovely big windows bringing in lots of sunlight lots of bright natural light into this space I kind of like the darker cabinets in this home they do have uh, online pictures that show this in white but I kind of like the darker cabinets in this home really it's up to your discretion right you can change the countertops or the cabinets really up to you you can have um take the shelving down you can make that whole area shiplap it's a lot of things that you can do in that area can lighting in this kitchen lots of cabinets on either side of the island i love the contrast with the white island there and I love the fact that even with all the windows in the dining room, you have so much light coming in from all of those windows over the sink. Got a big industrial sink here. And again, lots of cabinet space and open shelving. Nice touch adding this additional window, even though you have this large picture window over the sink. So really lovely. You have a butcher block type countertop on this island and deep uh, pot drawers here which is also 
a plus. So really lovely. Built-in microwave in this kitchen. Lots of storage space on every side of this island. Really beautiful. And if you haven't noticed, every cabinet has a drawer above it. So that's also nice. You'll have more space than you know what to do with. Love the hutch. It really goes well with the backsplash behind the uh, stove really nice absolutely go gorgeous love the fire burner ceramic top stove that's in this home that's something to remember when you're ordering your home you can choose the type of appliances whether they're black or or stainless steel whether they're the regular eyes or uh ceramic top so Keep that in mind if they have four burner and five burner ceramic top stoves as well. So really lovely. Really nice. Love the built-in microwave because it doesn't take up your counter sp space. You have a, a big area here if you want to make a drink station there. Just really lovely. And in addition to all of that storage space, you also have a pantry here. We'll take a look at that in a minute. I just want to give you another spin around the kitchen and then right here is a pantry huge pantry i will probably take the wire racks down and put regular shelving in there but listen you have space for appliances as well as food stuff so that is always a plus all of those uh pressure cookers and deep fryers and toaster ovens and all of that stuff that you don't want just sitting on the countertops you can close the door when you have company so really really lovely nice size kitchen y'all this whole house has plenty of space all the rooms are big really lovely and here's something my husband would appreciate on this side of the house you have a huge man cave absolutely love it they have a uh ceiling fan already built into the copper ceiling really pretty love the you have four windows in this room so lots of light in here just really beautiful beautiful space wide open space is off the kitchen away from the living room and so this definitely would make a good man cave now if you're not in need of a man cave this could, would make a terrific play area for the kids if all your kids lived on this side of the house and that was their common area or play area or if you had uh, a home school or this was you know a craft room or a multi-purpose room it just is the right size for any option that you want in the home and here we have the first additional bedroom now these bedrooms are carpeted love the darker gray carpet in here i believe if i'm not mistaken the bedroom might have a different color carpet but this is a model and you can choose what you like even if you decide not to put carpet in the rooms, it's really up to you. I think a lot of times people are turned off by home because it's some feature that they don't like. But what we fail to remember is that you don't have to buy the lot model. You can order the home the way that you would like to order it. So now we're in the laundry room. You got a nice area here for washing things by hand. A large, deep, rectangular sink. You've got cabinet space and counter space in this laundry room. You even have a drawer, you know, for those things that are always laying around. Scissors, pins, uh, stick pins, safety pins for clothes, needle and thread. Just whatever you need, little knickknacks that need to be put in a drawer. You've got space here for your washer and dryer. There's your side door. And then you even have space in this cubby if you want to put a deep freezer or whatever you choose to put in here additional storage is really up to you because the closet in this room is actually the ac unit and then behind that panel is your water heater so that's where if, if you ever wonder where those things are uh lots of times they're in the laundry room sometimes they're in a the hallway or in a closet i know our water heater is in my closet which is the primary bedroom's closet um, but it's right behind the AC unit that you can access from the laundry room. So here's your additional bathroom. It's shared by three bedrooms and the what I'll call man cave area. Love the counter space in this bedroom because if you have, you know, several kids and they share this bathroom, they have lots of space. 
huge uh, tub in here. You have a tub shower combo, but that tub is huge like a garden tub. So really nice. Love it, love it, love it. Then you have additional bedroom number two. If I have the measurements, of course, they'll be on the screen. Here's another great size room. Again, I love the dark gray carpet in here just so much space you guys this home definitely lives up to the name the boss because every room is in charge really love it love it love it love it you have uh so much space to do what you like when you walk in you have that little area there that a desk can go to you have an outlet so much that you can do uh these both of these additional bedrooms appear to be the same size again the measurements will be on the screen if I have access to them but you have three great additional bedrooms on this side of the house and that really makes for everyone having enough room and enough space in their home in their area of the home to move around so really nice job on this Oakwood home absolutely love it so far can't wait for you to see the primary bedroom so we will walk across the house and take a look at that Alright, so here is the primary bedroom. Again, another nice size room. Now, I really don't feel like the camera's doing the size of this room justice. But this really is a nice size bedroom. Um, you've got so much space in here to put a king size bed and whatever furniture you choose. You also have a huge primary bathroom. Love, love, love the built-ins as you walk in. It kind of gives it a spa-like feel. And you can kind of get an idea of how you would decorate that area right there. You've got a uh, huge uh, double uh, vanity for or double uh, sinks with lots of space for like doing makeup, having personal um, hygiene items there. You've got lots of cabinet and drawer space as well as a deep soaker tub love 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 that you've got all of this light coming in um right here where you soak just a really really beautiful space and you've got this huge huge uh primary uh shower really lovely so huge you could put a twin xl mattress inside that shower it's just that big i love the tile in this room they've uh, made space for your personal hygiene items just a really lovely space and I love the gold tones in the tile that they use here it works really well with the dark cabinets and the flooring so really lovely you got your water closet in a separate room and you've got this huge space for your primary closet needs love the fact that the door closes love the fact that you've got a transom window in here again i would take down that wire shelving and i might even call california closets to put come put a closet system in here because you really have enough space for it again there's your water closet so you can close that door off as well for privacy the only thing i don't care for with those water closets is not having um like a window that opens like for ventilation so those are the uh, barn doors that go on the opposite side of the house where the laundry room is i don't know i didn't point it out but there are the barn door rollers there and you can close them off the laundry room off to the rest of the house so really nice now again this is the boss you guys is at oakwood homes uh, I viewed this home a few months ago in Lexington, South Carolina. It's not on the website currently, but you can go see it in Greenville or you can call Lexington to find out when it will be in stock. So this is a four bedroom, two bath home. It has a living room and a bonus room, you guys. 
the uh, all in price is one ninety eight seven. It starts at one seventy five, and the all in price is one ninety eight seven. That includes basic setup and delivery. So, if you're interested in this home and you like to talk to some someone about it, you can go to Oakwood Homes in Lexington or Greenville, South Carolina, and tell them Christy from Homes and Things sent you.